Well, hello everyone. Hi, I'm Kay. And I'm Rue, and today we're in the kitchen with Kay. And what you got going on today? Something with almonds, right? Today we are making almond milk. Ah, we used to make it a while back, but then we kind of quit, and now we're starting to bring it back. What, right. What changed? Well, because, well, it's, it is a little bit of work, mm -hmm. but trying to make it as healthy as possible. You don't yeah. put any, so there's no uh, preservatives, mm -hmm. uh, thickeners, any other chemicals to preserve longer. So yeah. this milk will last about a week or maybe a couple more days. In maybe nine in the refrigerator, of course. And um, it's a very creamy, um, just wonderful with anything, anything yeah. a milk substitute. Yeah. And so, we use it with the coffee mostly. Uh, yeah, I had yeah. it this morning. So I guess what you're saying is because it's all natu natural and we've, we're not going to add any preservatives, of course, that you'll need to keep it refrigerated and it lasts about, what, seven to ten days? Yeah, is that? yeah, yeah. Okay. And then uh, I've always kind of shaken it up a little bit before I put well, it in my coffee. We're going to blend it for uh, about three minutes on high speed and okay. it keeps it really nice. Okay. Um, but if it doesn't settle, you have to kind of stir up a little bit. But all right, all right. Most of the time, it's just you know. Oh, I love it. Like it's, a regular it's really, milk. I yeah. missed it when it was gone. Now I've noticed that you're taking the skin off. Mm -hmm. Is is that to remove the lectins? I read yes. something online yes. about that. Yes. Yes. Okay. It looks like it comes off pretty easily. What's the secret there? Um, it's been soaking for 24 hours. Usually oh, wow. I soak it for 24 hours, but this one actually uh, sitting in the refrigerator for two days. Mm -hmm. And um, like you can see, the skin comes off really, really easy. Now I've seen some and channels where they add salt. Do you have to add salt to get the skin well, off? Well, you, yeah, so that's a good point. Um, you can add sugar, salt, uh, vanilla, any kind of flavors you want, you might like. But how about to get the skin off? Is it necessary to loosen the skin up, or can you just do no, plain no, water? No, just plain water. Oh, okay. Um, so you don't have to have that added salt just to get the skin off. Right, just That's the what water. I saw. Right, right. But, just the but water. But you were saying you kind of make it your way. I mean, well, I see some people uh, straining it with you know with a cheesecloth and squeeze all the mm -hmm. stuff out of it. But removing skin and just running a blender. For about three minutes on high speed, you just mm -hmm. you don't have to you don't have to go through that squeezing process, and it's a nice and smooth and rich. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah, is. it gives a really good flavor, and I don't add anything to it, mm -hmm. but you certainly can. You can make your own. You could probably add honey, I guess. Yeah, honey or. or could you uh, add maybe cane sugar? If right. you wanted a little sweet. Right. But if you want to eat with the cereal, they got sugar in there already. So yeah. try to cut, you know, try to stay, make it healthy as possible. So I just don't add anything and I don't miss it. I don't miss and anything. You, I've seen you use this in substitute of dairy and some of your other recipes. Right, right, right. <coughs> yeah. yeah. Today I only, I, I only soak uh, one cup. And okay. um, so one cup and three and a half cups of water. And if I need the water is too thick, I can still add some more, but usually three and a half cups water is sufficient. It's fine. Yes. All right. All right. So. And then we kind of make it in smaller batches. There's just the two of us. So right. We do that. We, so. don't, need, we don't need cereal. So just yeah. uh, we use for uh, smoothies mm -hmm. and uh, uh, coffee. Yeah. So this is uh, two cups. It's a little too much, I think, for a week. Yeah, for, for two people. Yeah, yeah. for us. Yeah. But if you use the... Uh, uh, if you eat with a cereal, yeah, you might want to yeah. stick you, with the you two cups. You do almond milk your way. I think what we're showing you, Kay's showing you, is a nice healthy base. Uh, you decide on, we like a little bit of pulp, so we have a little bit of texture in ours. We don't blend it as long, and Kay will go through that in just a minute. But if you want to blend it more and you want it more thin, I guess, and, and more filtered out, uh, you simply just blend it a little bit longer. What she's going to do next is uh, put them into the, uh, we use a Vitamix. We, we're not affiliated with the Vitamix folks, but it is a very powerful machine. Uh, and it seems to do a really good job when it comes to uh, making almond milk. And she is, looks like she's almost done. So our next step will be uh, putting these into the, uh, to the blender mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. adding water and uh, start making that milk, right? Yeah, I'm gonna rinse that, rinse one more time and then okay. pour it into um, blender. Okay, yeah, looks All like you, uh, they're less. nice and shiny. It looks like they swell up a little bit. Yeah, it did. Okay. So skinless almonds. So I'm gonna put in the blender with a three and a half cups of water, okay. I'm going to let it run for about three minutes. I taste a little milk. 
Oh, it looks good. Yeah. This is a really good consistency. Yeah. yeah. That's really good. Cheers. Yeah, you don't taste any pulps. It's no, a very smooth. It's really blended out. Yeah, so yeah. we did a um, two minutes and 40 seconds. So mm -hmm. I said earlier three minutes, but really not necessary. When I did for two cups of almonds, definitely mm -hmm. needed a three minutes, but just being a one cup. So I guess is, uh, what they can do is kind of blend a little bit, taste check it, it blend, yeah, blend, yeah, taste yeah, it. As just you see go. however you like to. Um, and, and would this be a good eye, uh, uh, time to add the, um, maybe the honey or sugar or anything? Not, not while you're blending. Not while you're blending? What while, you no, no, while you're blending. Oh, while you're blending. Okay, that makes more sense. Yeah, this is the perfect amount for us. So yeah, it really is. So, I always did two cups, but yeah. the one cup is just perfect for us. In a picture, this is cold. Yeah, that's a quart there. Right. So that, that turned out really nice. So I guess um, pretty simple to make. I mean, really Very not simple. And it, I mean, you couldn't make it healthier. Yeah. So next time we're gonna be making soy milk. So please come back and. Yeah, the next video, let's do that. Yeah. Maybe, uh, I know you're gonna run to the Asian market and pick up some stuff. So we'll do that. Right. Is, uh, is the process similar or is that a lot different? Yeah, we have to soak it overnight and with mm -hmm. that you have to cook. Yeah. We have to cook the beans. Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. So, All right, so there you have it, almond milk. Um, we'll put the recipe in the uh, description. And, uh, but really to make it simple, I think it was one cup of skinned almonds that soaked. One cup of skinned, skinned almonds All and right. three and a half, half cups of water. How long did you blend it? Uh, actually, two minutes and 40 seconds. Okay. It's, it's very smooth. You don't, mm -hmm. you don't feel any pulps or anything. Yeah. So you don't have to, you don't have to squeeze it. Squeeze. Um, oh, filter it. Filter yeah, it. Yeah, that's, yeah. 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 So. Yeah. So it's really good. Um, you know, put in the comments if you have anything to add or maybe some suggestions or anything you've done with them. We'd love to share it with the community because that's how, uh, that's how it starts. That's how you learn. But if you could do us a big favor, we're a relatively new channel. You probably saw we don't have a lot of videos, but if you could uh, subscribe and like, and then yes, if you uh, could make sure you, mm -hmm. uh, make sure you put those comments in there. So I think that's it. That's it. But we'll be making soy milk uh, that's on, right. on soy our next video. So All right. Well, cheers everyone. Cheers. Until next time. Bye. Bye.